con el pueblo boliviano y con la democracia en nuestro país. In a stunning turn of events in Bolivia, a top general and his allies attempted to storm the presidential palace, launching a dramatic coup attempt that quickly fell apart within hours. The general was taken into custody on live TV, setting the stage for an unprecedented showdown. Bolivian television captured the chaos as security forces in riot gear flooded the main square in La Paz. A camouflaged military vehicle rammed the palace door and soldiers made their move, but just as quickly as it began, the coup unraveled. General Juan José Zúñiga vanished from sight, his military supporters retreated, and police loyal to President Luis Arce took control. President Arce emerged onto the plaza, rallying Bolivians to defend democracy. Long leave the Bolivian people, he proclaimed in a fiery televised address. Long leave democracy. The entire ordeal, from start to finish spanned just three tense hours, and as the dust settled, it became evident that General Zuniga's coup had little backing. In a shocking twist, just before his arrest, Zuniga alleged that President Arce himself had orchestrated the coup attempt to boost his popularity, a claim made without evidence. Moments later, police whisked the general away in a white truck. In response, a key minister in Arce's government, Eduardo del Castillo, dismissed Zuniga's accusations, stating that both Zuniga and Vice Admiral Juan Arnes, a co-conspirator, have lost all credibility. A coup that could have changed Bolivia's future instead became a riveting tale of political intrigue, rapid reversals, and a fight for democracy. Like and subscribe and don't miss a moment of any unfolding drama.